we've discussed your tools. Now, uh, we were looking at this Bentley engine block, and this is a real-life application. What Absolutely. tools were used for this engine block, and what machines, etc.? Yeah, that's right, Gio. I mean, you saw the Model T Ford earlier on. Um, th that's where it all started, um, and this is what it's evolved to. Uh, this is the Bentley 6 and 3 quarter litre V8 engine block that goes in the Mulsanne. Um, what we do on this block is uh, it's basically a variation of the ZX range of tools. Um, so we have a tool here that goes in through the crank bore um, and thrusts on the, on the face of the bore um, and converts radial movement into axial, um, axial cutter feed um, and it machines the thrust face on the inside of the, uh, on the face of the, the crank bore. And, it, and in, for layman terms, basically you're putting internal grooves into this and you're also doing intermittent cutting and in different materials. Yeah, that's right. It's an inter intermittent cut um, and it's also bimetal, as you say. It's aluminium block and a steel cap. So this is a really great example of, you know, people can see your tools, but you want to give people um, an indication of what kind of components they can be used. Yep, yep. Uh, the kind of... The uh, elite components or the elite customers that we're dealing with, this was manufactured by Granger and Worrell, um, and it, it was um, with kind permission of Granger and Worrell that, uh, that we have this uh, in our reception area. And also, um, on, this, on this part, we've manufactured tools for um, line boring tools, chef cut uh, reamers for doing the crank um, and the cam bore, finishing uh, both, those, uh, both those bores.